bottom cover is a little bit better for them. Oh, is it really? Oh, okay, yeah, well then that, that probably worked out. Helps out, diffuses the light a little bit for what they're saying, but the pride of Pensacola and our Blue Angels and the pride of August has been more September weather that we've had for a majority of the month. Yes. And we begin September and we're going to go feel like August. How we about had to that get it at some point, didn't Flipped we? Flipped around. Yeah, well, it's still summer technically. We're not going to hit fall, you know, until we... Uh, was it November, right? Yep, that's that's when we're going to hit the fall season, right? So that's technically when you think of the seasons are changing, right? That's when we do it by the calendar, when most of us do it. Here are the temperatures at the time of the night, still upper 70s to around 80 degrees. These are temperatures much warmer than we've done previous nights because there's much higher humidity. Now, let's start with a different view, Washington. Let's get a look at the nation's capital here. We've got Lincoln Memorial, Washington Monument, the capital in the distance. This is coming from the Iwo Jima Memorial, the Netherlands, Carolyn, looking back. All beautifully lit up tonight, and you can even see some of the, the tidal basin coming in, some of the water in front of the Lincoln Memorial are there. Actually, not too bad. Pretty calm in some spots, lack of a breeze. Now, high temperature, only 87, could have easily done 90. In fact, 90 was hit in New York City. And that was actually Central Park, you know, within the, the park area. Sometimes can be a bit cooler, 87 degrees here because of the layer clouds that have been here for a better part. Do you see what's going down into the Mid-South? Little Rock, Pierce, South Dakota. Some serious heat once again, some 90s coming in. We'll tap into that eventually. What we've got here is a massive showers coming down and that's what I'm tracking in a weak cold front and it's just very weak. It's running into the heat and humidity that's being kind of churned up a little bit by a little bit of a spin, but really it's about these light rain showers. Will we get some showers this is the big thing. Will they even hold together as they move here? Well, such high humidity is here, so you don't need a whole lot for you to get that rain to fall. So we'll track the rain early tomorrow morning and then we'll watch the heat and humidity. It's the big picture over the next two days presented by Geico starting off Monday going to Tuesday. So we'll reset and restart our forecast, go back to the exact same outlook, just real close in. Overnight tonight to tomorrow morning, the latest indications are we could have and should have scattered showers around 7, 8 o'clock in the morning hours. So it shifted a little bit later instead of early 3 into 4, shifting back to maybe the tail end of the morning rush hour, but that's still going back to school. And that's more standing at the bus stop weather where the showers could be here. It's light, it's spotty, it's steady rain at the heaviest, but it does still appear likely that that batch of rain is going to be here. Low temperature. You don't need to stay cool at the bus stops or warm at the bus stops tomorrow morning. It's actually going to be about the humidity in 60s to 72. By afternoon, a widely isolated thunderstorm. It's warm. More cloud cover should hold temperatures kind of like today back a little bit under 90 degrees in many areas. And then a widely scattered storm is possible going in towards Tuesday. But that's the start of one of our hottest day, which is the start of September. Lower to mid 90s actual air temperatures. Factor humidity. It's the heat index. Feels even hotter than that. Now, Tuesday, Thursday, you don't see any rain chances, or even next Sunday, you could put a 20% chance of their isolated storm. But likeliest rain days now, the light rain tomorrow morning, Wednesday afternoon, scattered storms going to Labor Day weekend, Friday, Saturday. I'm a little disappointed about the rain tomorrow on the first day of school. Mm. I know, but it's just light, it's spotty, it's okay. not going to be a huge problem. Just want to prepare you for it. Yeah, mm. but the new shoes are going to get all messed up. Mm. This is really oh, problematic. Sorry. Yeah. It's oh, a well. problem, put a bag over. Speaking of problematic <laughs> yes. issues here, it's too a lot much. going on with the Redskins and RG3. It. Does I he have a future it. with the Skins? What's going on here? <sighs> I'm not going to be the one to answer that. Oh, <laughs> Somebody <laughs> needs to, right? Exactly. Okay. So much has <laughs> happened over the last three days with the Redskins. What's scary is the season hasn't even started yet. And more tightness for Steven Strasburg. We got Nats and Marlins next in sports. Introducing the Airbrush Beauty Breakthrough, Luminous Air. 